I'm Callista at Risk Five, and we're here at Embedded World, and I'm talking with Danny from Sci Five. Hi. Danny, tell me a little bit about uh, Sci Five and what you guys are doing. Hi, my name is Danny Nativel. I lead the platform security team at Sci Five, and uh, Sci Five is uh, known for its uh, Risk Five uh, cores and SOCs that really uh, try to make a change and uh, to the the, the Risk Five world. So Sci Five has been around the world, literally, as well as bringing so many different technology uh, tools and resources to the environment. What is Sci5 doing to really help engineers work in methods, ways, modes that they are used to working in and bringing those types of experiences to Risk V? On the security side, we, we are really trying to bring them a similar or even better uh, um, experience that they used to have in the past with other cores by providing a seamless integration of security on the RISC V core. Okay, so you're at Embedded World and, and what is your demo about today? What are, you, what are the types of things that you're sharing at Embedded World? So today I'm very excited to uh, introduce you to the, uh, the world, world first live demo of WorldGuard, which is a, a hardware enforced uh, multi-domain security architecture for RISC V. Wow, so this is great. And is this something that uh, you have been working on together with other Risk Five partners and members, or is this something that Sci Five recognized a need and stepped up to the challenge? So we stepped up to the challenge, but we're now promoting this architecture to the Risk Five Foundation, hoping for broader adoption by other Risk Five members. Yes, exactly. And, you know, I, I literally see Sci Five everywhere in the world. Where are you seeing? Both geographically as well as industry, the most interest in Risk Five. Like, what do you see coming forward first in adoption? People want to move away from the existing, you know, world they know about, the core they know about, and for that they need a seamless path uh, for uh, software, security, and other things. So they want a way to move away from the existing to the future, having a future-proof solution. Uh -huh. So do you see interest in a particular industry happening earlier? It's, it's all over the place. It's IoT, it's a data center, automotive. It's, it's everywhere. I mean, Risk5 is everywhere today. So disrupting the business model, having choice and variety in the supply chain, in the customers, the addressable market, all of those things are really important, and that's disruptive on the business model. I see you're also really working on some of the disruptions in the technical aspects, right? So making sure it's a composable core and composable in ways that are secure and reliable. Can you talk a little bit more about the security initiatives that you're working on? So basically, we wanted to bring on the table a, a way to secure the WIS-5 um, uh, in a way that customer can move their software environment to the risk five without worrying about uh, the uh, added support for security. So we are providing a seamless way to properly isolate uh, cores, tasks running on the core, on the risk five core, to uh, secure and, and isolate those and provide a better security. Excellent. Well, thank you so much. I really appreciate your time today. Thank you very thank much. You.